old habits die hard. I'm a big proponent of establishing habits and routines that would actually carry you throughout all the times, throughout the hard times, throughout the easy times, because you can always fall back on them. And I found it so powerful because even now, with very little time or very little sleep, I manage because I have a baby. If you're if you're new to this podcast and you're not sure um, what I'm talking about, I still do manage to get the daily movement in to do my uh, to put on my creams and do some self care rituals and even do this podcast episodes and record it. And I think it's because we are so wired to build the habits and then actually once we do have a habit it's easier to do that thing than not to do that thing of course at times we have big disruptors in our environment and that could cause it's um harder it can make it harder to do it even if it is a habit but um it's the easiest way to succeed is to have those habits that actually help you to move towards your goals and then it's easier to have the life that you would like to have, then not the life that you would, then not that life, because the thing it's easier to do the thing. <laughs> you can see my brain is being impacted by lack of sleep, but I hope you are getting my point. And um, I wanted to ask you, where in which rituals or habits have you already established that are actually helping you and are moving you towards your goals, and how did you establish them? Because maybe for some other areas in your life or some other goals of yours, you can also think of habits and rituals, something that you can do on a daily basis to help you achieve those goals and and employ the same strategy that you did with the habits that you've already established that are working for you. And also think about the habits that are not working for you and think of them, how can you actually break them or with which habits you would like to replace them. Because old habits die hard, they will be there no matter what, no matter your life circumstances, it is... It is very important to have good habits to fall back on and to slowly replace the bad ones with the ones that actually will help us. Hope you enjoyed this episode and I hope to see you in the next one tomorrow.